An investigation reveals one of the most powerful governors in the country sexually harassed multiple women and violated state and federal laws. New York's Andrew Cuomo now faces new calls to resign. CBS reporter Michael George on the fallout. A defiant New York governor, Andrew Cuomo, challenged an independent investigation's findings that he sexually harassed multiple women. I never touched anyone inappropriately or made inappropriate sexual advances. The investigation found all 11 accusers credible. The investigation found that Governor Andrew Cuomo sexually harassed current and former New York State employees by engaging in unwelcome and non-consensual touching and making numerous offensive comments of a suggestive and sexual nature. Investigators say an employee who they identified as executive assistant number one endured repeated physical violations. The governor hugged executive assistant number one and reached under her blouse to grab her breast. The five-month investigation also found the governor's administration created a hostile work environment. The governor and his senior team took actions to retaliate against at least one former employee for coming forward. But this investigation doesn't carry any penalties. Whether or not Governor Cuomo will face civil or criminal charges will be up to the accusers and law enforcement. We're not only dealing with the possibility of criminal trials, criminal cases and civil cases, but we're really dealing with his political future. The attorney general's report is expected to factor into whether the New York State Assembly decides there are grounds for impeachment. Michael George, CBS News, New York. In a tweet following the release of the report, at least one of Cuomo's accusers, Charlotte Bennett, called on Cuomo to resign.